Hello everyone, Asterburn here, coming 101, going to do another review. A lot of my videos are being shuffled around on my computer, so I had, can't find the one where I, uh, I'm actually opening this toy right here. And if I did, I'm sorry if I confused you on what I put the videos and all that. But anyways, TD Tossing Leonardo right here. Now a lot of you who are, who are not totally sure what's going on out there, this is the reissue, 2016, of the 1991 Tossing Leo. I believe TD is, you know, Touchdown, Tossing Leo, or something like that, or Turtle Down, I don't know. But, I already did this review of him already. Um, if you want to go check it out, believe it or not, I just found it on my, on internet. Uh, it's Shell number 16, if you want to see the original, but, no problem. I could just put it underneath this video, so you go scroll this down, see all these cool places to go get your Ninja Turtle toys, or any other kind of toys, really, and um, click on our link and go straight to their page, and underneath that is where it says more review. Anything that's related to this and the series will be underneath this one, so you go ahead and check out those reviews. I'm pretty sure there's a few of them I need to redo, because uh, due to the copyrights of uh, music, because I actually put Came After Him themes in there and Depeche Mode and stuff like that so they slapped me with the cover right and they muted, muted a lot of my videos so I probably had to redo a lot of those but anyways uh, check us out I found this at a comic book store it's a, actually a DC collectible um, what do you call it a little f frisbee looking thing this is where it has this little loop right here let's see on the bottom uh, this, this is actually yeah DC comic Collectibles, but I didn't. That's not gonna stop me because it's actually perfect because it's black. Barely see it. The DC thing we have these things on here, unless you have a lighter trying to focus on it, and they fit perfect right on it. So we're gonna do up and close because there is a little problem behind this figure right here. No, it's not because the color, because the football. I believe the football is supposed to be a different color as well. Um. Yeah, the mask right here is supposed to be red, and the football is supposed to be green. So, what's up with this Flamemates? It's the one thing I'm kind of concerned about. And I know I'm getting used to the whole, when I shouldn't, getting used to the whole, well, there's missing paint job and all that stuff. But, have no fear. That's not your biggest problem here. Now, if you have the exact problem what I have with this toy, put your comments down real quick, like, like right when you see it, put your comments down. But if you're if you don't have this problem, write it out. And say hey, mine doesn't do that. Then maybe I will go out and buy another turtle toy of this one. But then again, how do I know if that's the right one? All right, guys. So up and close. All right, people. <laughs> Get a load of this. Are you ready? And the old TD. I should just say tossing Leo. You're supposed to pull the arm back and it shoots, right? Mine doesn't do that. Why, you ask? Because you gotta go this way. And then, woo! See that? Yeah. So, Playmates, you really, really screwed this one up. Why is it supposed to go backwards? And not only that, this one actually, honestly, I think they made that a little bit too big. But I mean, it goes in, it holds it pretty, very, very nice. But you gotta do it just right. I know I did it. Ah, it's not doing it. There it goes, and now I can't find it. <laughs> it's in my closet. Oh man, hold on. Okay, so I found it. So these little balls right here, the football. Um, how do I put this? They're supposed to be green, the original one. There's also, I guess you call it a Europe version. They're actually blue. As you can see, it says. Yeah, the long bomb. And then, of course, if you remember, um, what was it? Under, under, uh, what was it? Disguise, um, Don Tello. 
over how he looks like his own disguise in old school. And he had, it was black. Well, here's one right here. There's uh, yellow, which is supposed to be green also. It's a pepperoni pizza. And just a regular football right there. And that's supposed to be green. The helmet. And believe me when I say this, the plastics are way different. Like, oh my god, this is way different. Um, for this one as well, the front part of the helmet is supposed to be red. Not only that, as you can see the T on the side of the helmet, the original one, it's, it's actually uh, supposed to be red. They're supposed to paint that, but obviously didn't. And of course, uh, his face... There's also a screaming hell. I'm not going to check because it might be those clowns out there. Anyways, as you can see, they didn't paint all of this. Oh, here's my favorite. There is no Leonardo print. He's supposed to have Leo right here on the back. They didn't do that. <sighs> you guys, seriously, what's up? And then, if we can see it. Man, it's really in there. Zoom up. It says, actually it says 2015. Viacon made in Hong Kong. Which is weird because, you know, 1991. <coughs> Morgan Studio. So, and oh yeah, I forgot to mention, his socks are black. The original socks were red. As you can see. Man, someone's really yelling out there. And over here, luckily they painted the one. Strangely enough, they actually painted the part right here, the rip shirt for his um, pads. His belt is actually painted nicely. Uh, there was no L. On here, supposed to be an L for Leo, of course, dear. Everything else looks okay besides those. Pads were never painted. But the whole hand thing, seriously. I mean, what the heck, man? Okay, guys. Uh, you know. <laughs> well, obviously, this could turn, which is a good thing. Like a turn as well. Just your old school joints, really. Of course. This is probably turn left and right, but this thing. Yeah. So, anyways, you get these things. Place underneath his little, little hole right here because the hole over here is not, you know, there's a hole right there. I see a one print right there on his feet. Over here has a three. I believe the yellow for the other one was actually a little bit lighter for his chest piece. They didn't. This part right here was actually green on his side. The way they didn't paint that, I just decided to paint, you know, whatever. And you don't, well, I, I swore, but yeah, there he goes, yeah. Why didn't I just see that? Yeah, they painted this perfectly, the, the lace and the crotch part area. Luckily. But. I mean, I love this toy. I really love this toy. This is like the coolest toy ever. I just wish the arm was actually working. I mean, if I find another 2016 reissue one open and I could move his arm... And it does go for it, then I'll, I'll get it. But you never know if you open another, you know, another tossing Leo and all of a sudden ours is the same thing. You just pretty much wasted your money. But, yeah, I mean, that's the paint job. I mean, not fully all there. Uh, the plastic, like I said, the, compared to the old version and the new version, the plastic's actually pretty sweet. I mean, they're totally different. I'm not kidding. They're all different. So... There you go. 
And we'll look, put this one on there instead. Place them on my thing, and voila. So, of all the things out there, they're doing a lot of reissues. I mean, a lot. And these are, I believe, Series uh, Classic 3, maybe? You got the regular turtles, Krang for soldier. Yeah, and then these guys. It was Delta Dawn, Toss and Leo, and then Skate and Michelangelo, which I'm gonna do, do next. And then uh, the new ones they have this I think is Dark Dawn, like you know the superheroes. Dawn and then oh shoot, there's another one. Dawn and someone else. Shoot. I had to look it up, but anyways, I, I'm going to look for those. And these are all only at Toys R Us if you want to get to the, the actual place. Toys R Us are the only people who are actually selling these. Walmart or Target are not, which is kind of sucks. But yeah, Toys R Us, people. This is where you go get them. Uh, share this with your friends. I mean, guarantee it that they're going to be like either happy or, oh, you know, you know I, I can live past the whole color changing thing. It's just the arm thing. You know what I mean? So, uh, what else? Push the like if you like this review. I'm pretty sure you're probably laughing really, really hard when you saw the arm thing. Um, yeah, so if your arm of Tossy Leo does the same thing, put it down. But, seriously, if your arm is actually not like mine, um, send me a video. I like to see on Facebook, Instagram, or, or even on here, tag me. I want to see your guys' videos to see it actually work. And show me... The 2015, the um, date. I don't want to think it's, you know, the other one. And I think that's it. Pretty sure a lot of people are going to dislike this because, of the, like I said, the paint job and the arm. But either way, I do. Oh, I always love tossing Leo. That's the thought. It was pretty sweet looking. All right. Well, that's it for now. I'm going to be doing my Galangelo snacks and then. Hunt down the other one, so the next reissue turtles. I know a lot of you are like, why did you open it? Well, it's because I want to play with it. Okay, I love playing with my toys. Uh, I might go buy another one, maybe, and then keep it inside a seal, so I won't, so I can have one inside of a package, and I can have one open to play with. So I think that is it, people. Um, nothing else you can say. Uh, I know I haven't been oozing a lot lately, but I promise you there's going to be a really cool video of nothing but ooze straight through. So, um, that's it. Uh, I don't know what else to say, but I hope I can find my video on my computer of me opening this up and showing everything on it. Alright, um, that's it. Talk to you then. Happy hunting, everyone. See you later.